Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Bug Fables the Everlasting Sapling. This has been a great past few episodes, but now it's time to get back to the journey at hand, finally. Wait a moment. Wait a moment. Halt on that. Halt on that. You're back. Let's see how you've done with that metal mine. Hmm, good job folks. You've defeated that hard on Venus Guardian. Was it too challenging? You deserve a reward. Here, take this. Spiky bod, man. Wind block and Kabu will damage enemies that touch him with his horn. <gasps> oh ho, you've been on a roll. Be zasp too, hey? Here, take this as well. Break metal. Grants leaf the break skill, which reduces an enemy's defense for two turns. Beat Monger Scarlet too? <gasps> Life steal and metal reduces an ally's attack by one, but their attacks will steal life from enemies. Come back later when you've bonked some extra hard heads with that metal, will you? I need more metal points. Wow. <laughs> Maybe I can't- I just can't have all of them equipped. To be honest... Uh, I don't... Sleep resist, that's kind of useless for us. Life stealer. Oh, damage enemies with this horn. Hmm. I think this would be best on Kabu. Because that way, defense doesn't really affect him. So I think that'd be alright. Ah, I don't know, I don't know. One of these things here. Okay. You know what? Spike bod. That. Um. Favorite one. Quick flea. Spike bod. Life stealer. Oh my. Oh my. Spike bod. Life stealer. Steal life from enemies. It doesn't say that it's one life, so I'm guessing it's the damage ideal. Oh my. That, I get the feeling this might be. Life stealer might be something I turn off and on again. Because I could do a tornado strike while my enemy is frozen, and that would generate like 7 health. You know, I'm just gonna do this for now, and we'll see how things go. <coughs> yeah, that was an interesting set of metals we got. We'll have to keep at it. <laughs> it has appeared in the path to Lost Sands. Be careful when heading that way. Sure thing, bud. We're so hyped! I'm so hyped! I love this game so much! Ugh. What was that? You joking? Wait, what? Bug meat not. Hard hits, turn that off. Let's turn bug meat not off. I want. Just because we level doesn't mean I should be able to, like, mess with them a bit. Oh my, what's this? Uh, let me check my inventory here. Map of Bugaria. We're still on the outskirts. This could be where the hidden thing is. Hmm. <coughs> oh, hello there. Oh, he he hello there. I- God, lord. Um... Okay. We should probably have Kabu in front then. And... It's time to take a look at you, bud. An underling. One of these was used in the card battle. Dear Venus, we must truly 
must we truly deal with such stubborn and irritable creatures? 12 HP? I could try to dig after it myself. I've seen actually more than one. Oh, uh -oh. but we'll have to rely on Leaf to unearth it instead. Ouch. Ow! What? Oh, I forgot about that. How'd you deal so much damage? Hard hits must still be on because you're not supposed to deal that kind of damage. Um, break. Oh, I see. Ice wall. That's ridiculous. Yeah. Ow. Poison crap. Get rid of you. Get out of here. You. Do your usual, bud. Ow. 1 XP. What is this? Hard hits was not on? What? I don't understand how that one regular seedling dealt so much damage then. Hmm. Huh. Okay. That was weird. <clears throat> I don't know what this is. A peculiar cave. Huh? There's nothing here, just a rock. We can feel magic coming off this cavern. It's hiding something. There's a hole. Something could fit in here. Hmm. Okay. Okay. We must be missing that something. It's probably up ahead. Nope, nothing there. Well. I didn't break these yet. Just want to break all these bushes at least once. I can't believe this guy. Wait, isn't it pointless to fight these things? Because they, they only give 1 XP. That's not gonna kill you, is it? No. Hmm. Alright, that should be good. Should, should work out well. Gonna dig into the earth. I'm going to do this to you. And then V is going to finish you off. Weird. Mm -hmm. Danger, Spud. Okay. The standard stock hit sick EM super sweet. Restores 1 HP to an ally at price. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and have a leaf salad on all three of our buds here. 
Which sounds crazy, I know. Eh, what the heck. No, no, we can wait on that. Hmm. Looks like we could go across there, if possibly. And we might need something. Okay, you guys know about... Um... How should I put it? Let's see. The Golden Hills? We went to the right and there was an area much like that that we couldn't get to. Maybe we'll, we'll need to go back to that in the future. Maybe there's a hidden object or something. There must be. Hmm. Yeah, well, about this. Yeah, I, I don't I don't want to deal with these these guys. Uh, toxic gamma. Danger spun my bad. Ah, jeez, how does this bridge work? Where's the worker? I hope we cross soon. These underlings don't play nice at all. Lost Sands is to the north. East is Metal Lake Bugari up here. West is the Ant Kingdom. Well, you're in luck, guys. There you go. Whoa, thanks. Mm-hmm. We were stuck here for a while. It wasn't much. We'll get going now. See you in Defiant Root. Be careful now. Hmm. Those little mounds, they're gonna be so useful at some point. I, I can tell. Wait a moment. So we have access to Mel Lake now? <gasps> Don't even... It still says we're in Bulgaria outskirts. Well, that metal lake would be like... I guess there's no spe specified section for it. What's this? Uh, we don't really know how to describe it. It's a steering wheel leaf. A what? It's to drive boats around in the water. Hmm, even when you explain it's hard to imagine it, how it works. Back then, boats were way simpler. Well, you do have to study a lot to drive a boat. We feel quite outdated. Keep your head high, Leaf. There's so much to discover that in this pier. Yay, learning. <laughs> if I'd known there was this here. Huh? With these gadgets, I can put my face under wire and look around. Someday I'll see the sea's hidden mysteries. Just imagine, guys, living in a bug world. If there were no people, the Earth was Earth was same size as it is now, and but you're a bug. The exploration value is crazy. Come and eat the best seafood at Pier Stop. Now served, serving roasted berries. We got your Pier special offer: Meadow Island round trip. Previously, 500 berries per bug. Now only a hundred berries per bug, limit time only. A hundred berries! Are you insane? Maybe I don't have that much. It's a shame, but they've run out of tea. Oh, the flavor of... Oh, the flavor a leaf and some water can bring forth. Hello there, welcome to Pierce Stop. Nice day we're having, huh? What can I get for you today? There's a roasted berry special and some freshly squeezed juice too. Why not? Or a roasted berries coming right up to the party. Oh, that's so cool! Restores two HP to the entire party. That's um, that's abs actually really cool. Hey there. Hey, gear. Are you by chance Edel's friend? Hmm. I. Why? Something happened. Eh, t surprise, heh <laughs> surprise, Sir Edel's got something for you. 
Ah, uh, he got the thing finally. What is it? A super rare metal? Just a part to improve my cure. You gotta thank Edel for me. Why do you make such a big deal of it then? What matters is it's been delivered safely. What matters is the reward, Kabu, Kabu the important part. This should about cover the walk, thanks to you. Crazy prepared metal. Prevents enemies from striking first out of battle. Oh. We don't see why you'd want to go underwater, but good luck with your gear. Hey bud, I need you to freeze all this. Oh man. But yeah, we completed the quest. So, and we got a reward as well. Yeah, that is actually quest complete. Awesome. So this metal, pretty much as it says, they can't strike first. Folks be thinking of the sea as some vacation nowadays. They best watch out because it don't play around. That poor sailor. What do you reckon happened to him? Dunno. It's just the sea. I feel like it'd be best if we didn't try to figure out. It could be most unpleasant. Running the quest board's so boring. I miss staring at the sea from our boat. This book's fashion sense is impeccable. How about me? You're doing just fine. Oi, just say I look good. I mean that 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 uh flea in uh at the kingdom will say you look good. Hmm. Hmm, you look disappointingly poor. Uh go of decency. Would you three fancy traveling around to Meadow Island? Three hundred berries for the round trip. Let's go. What no money, no trip. Get out of here. Grr. Er, V? How can they charge so many berries for a boat ride? It's insane. We thought you hated the war, V. You don't get tired on boat. And it's way less tiring than flying to an island. Um... The boat must be quite expensive to maintain. I don't care, it's too many berries. Guess we'll have to save up or wait for a bear deal. I see you! I see you, my sweet little berry. Well then. 300 berries! Are you joking? I could farm for a few hours and get that, but still. Ouch. <laughs> hey, is that... Is that an enemy? Or is that just like, hey, how's it going? Hey, it's you two, or three again. Venus. Hee <laughs> hee, yes, that's me. I just said to help you in your quest. Really? You're gonna be up stuff with us? I'm not a combat goddess, but I can heal you up in no time. You know, for a small offering of eight berries. What? Why would a goddess need money? Listen, Arya and my followers want to thrive in life too. And they are way too dedicated to, to me to get other jobs, so it's the least I can do for them. Besides, eight, eight berries is nothing for adventurers like you. Sounds like a fair deal, team. It, it helps us and Venus's followers. Mm-hmm. Just shove the berries into in the spud's mouth when you want some healing, alright? So Venus really is acro all across Bulgaria. Well, she's like a super goddess, right? Indeed. That she would bless us with her healing. Be I'm beyond grateful. Wait a moment. What what Leaf say? I didn't catch that. Oh my word. Ah. I thought it was going to save, like, for a price. Oh, hello there. Hey, explorers, the queen has allowed you to go through. Go on in. Please do be careful. The number of bandits roaming the sands has been increased, increasing lately. To reach the fire route, keep going northwest to the base of the big tree. Do not approach the wasp king kingdom border to the northeast. Stay clear from it. Well, now that you say that, I just have to. By the way, I do need a bit of a heal. Not really, actually. But a heal would be nice, so you know what? I'm going to do this. <coughs> now the gate opened. I can't go to the desert yet. I'm still preparing for my journey. If you plan on crossing the desert, keep in mind it is much bigger than it seems. Everywhere you look, sand. 
They're saying keep a mental map when you plan on crossing. Ah, uh, just like Paper Mario 1, Chapter 2. Right, let me make sure that this is not on. Oh, man. I uh, see you have a defense. You know what? Um, we need to do this after all. And yoink! I should put you in front. This, got, this one's going to hurt. I never did like these blasted Cycorps. Cycorps. Uh, Leaf, use your magic to unearth them. We must be careful, for they may faint before striking us with poison or sedatives. Seven. Defense one. Okay. Ouch. Ha 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 Yeah, you shouldn't have done that, bud. Not okay. You do not hurt Leaf. Not Leaf. I'm so sorry. V. Okay, so it looks like there's a ton of paths. The Lost Sands, we've come back at last. The heat never gets any less awful. You traveled all through this to get to the Ant Kingdom separately? Yeah, it would have been way easier with feet around though. Hey <laughs> hey, same to you. Well, it's nice to have a guide through the way you two. I need a few more berries, so... Jeez. Oh! Yeah, let's not step in that again. Ow. Okay. I see that over there. But be careful, don't fall into the quicksand. <gasps> Who are you? Bro, back off with the underlying crap. I don't want to deal with you. You know what? Let's get you out here. Let's have you attack once. And then I guess I'll attack you. Hold on though. I want to spy on you. Incredible. I truly believe this to be a cactus. My impressive disguise, Cactoline. Advance to HP 8. Still, if it stands in our way, I shall flip it over. Let's go, team. Um. Let me give my turn to you, bud. So we can unearth this guy. You took damage because I have that spiky shell, guys. Uh, ice fall. Bruh, come on now. Don't even. It's okay, bud. You're you're all right. Yoink. And I will hit you with this. And same for you, bud. Flipped. Bam. And defeated. 
Six XP points. Amazing. Succulent berry. And what did that do? Succulent berry. Stores 2 HP to an ally for three turns. Oh! Oh, okay. So, 2 HP for three turns. So that's 6 HP total. That's pretty cool. We're getting some stronger stuff now. But now, it is time... I'll tell you in the episode. It's time to... Take this off. Like me not, I guess. Not not for now, actually. We'll, we'll do this. You guys, Venus here. Yes. Let's talk. Ahead. Yes. Yes. Um Not even my roots can reach all of the desert. Okay. Heal us. Venus special healing. Beautiful, thank you so much. Alright. I guess we're heading into the Lost Sands, guys. Next episode. <laughs> um, let me make sure. Yeah, it's, it's a little early, but let's end the episode here, guys. Mm. Um. Let's see. Yes, here we go. The Lost Sands. Wow. That's crazy. When you think about it, the Bug Kingdom. A Bug Kingdom could literally be someone's backyard. It's so crazy. I mean, the world is a vast place even for humans, but just imagine if you were a bug. That's so cool. Ugh. Thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you all again next time.